You know, I absolutely love my bike. I love it. I just finished washing it, and I love what it looks like. You know what I mean? I love the black, I love the blue, I love the silver. The off silver there, it's kind of like a gray actually. But uh, honestly, I was wondering how it would actually look with the Hunter Edition taillights on this thing, but it just looks amazing. I, to me, it's not the LED package like is on the um, higher models or whatever, right? But you know, the storage box on the back, um, heated grips, all that stuff that I put on this thing. Um, I just think all the money I spent on this bike, the ECU flash, all of it, everything. Uh, I did take off the uh, LED bar that I had on it um, because I had an issue actually with the LED relay. Um, so I just decided to remove everything for now until I can get that figured out. But, um, you know, washing your bike, I don't always wash my bike, but I tried my best to maintain it. Um, fresh oil change, all that kind of stuff. And uh, that, that blue light is still, still in there, right there. Um, you can see the other one back there. Um, but yeah, that one broke off. And um, I did a review on Amazon for it. And uh, the nice thing is, is that uh, the guys, they sent me a, a brand new set. So that was a brand new ball that actually broke off. But I just thought I'd take this short video here real quick and share it with you guys, you know. Uh, 2017 570 you know she's been she's been a great bike to me and um you know like ever since i had that ecu flash the, the power on this thing is just awesome i really do enjoy this bike and um i can't see myself riding anything else anytime soon i granted i you know i was at polaris yesterday and uh, i had to order an exhaust today i realized that's actually what's going on with my bike right now is i, I need an exhaust so i ordered the exhaust today but i was looking at the new uh, 2020 um, XP 1000S, the 55 uh, 55 inch. Now I know there's a lot of people that were upset about the 55. You know, I'm not going to go into it, but looking at that bike, I thought one of the problems that I have with this one here is that I don't feel that safe on it. That's why I bought my side by side. But I do love this. Don't get me wrong for trail riding and everything else like that. But anyway, uh, I don't know what your feelings are about the 570. Uh, leave a comment if you wish to um, subscribe to my channel, do all that kind of stuff. This is just a unprompt video that I decided to do after just washing my bike. It's freshly cleaned, and I just thought I'd share it with you guys. You know, she's got a lot of miles on her. Turn this on. These speakers, um, you're going to hear a ding here. It doesn't matter if, um, oh, wow, you didn't hear a ding. That's weird. But anyway, so if I go like this here, I'll go to, yeah, right there. So I've got 7,494.8 kilometers on this bike, and I have 292.9 hours. For anybody to suggest, even for a second, that Polaris isn't reliable, um, show them this video. Share this video. Like, you know, I've got... All those miles on there or kilometers on this bike now it is in kilometers but that's that's a lot of kilometers that you know what i mean to be driving and not have an issue like i, like I said i did have a, I, I did have a clutch issue but the previous owner that's why he traded this in because he was having clutch issues i did just replace the belt that's got a brand new belt on it um i was actually gonna go do a video on it and i ended up not sorry guys it's not that hard to do really but yeah, so it's got a brand new belt on it. Literally just put on like two days ago. So um, with that, you, you feel it. You can actually tell when it's got a new new belt. But I'm not going to keep on going on, guys. Like I said, leave a comment. See, tell me what you guys think of the 570. Um, if you got a Can-Am, Honda, whatever. It doesn't really necessarily matter what you got. But obviously, if you're watching my channel, it's probably for the Sportsman 570 SP. Dual A-arms, um, downhill assist power steering, uh, EFI, and the 14-inch alloy wheels. All right, guys, thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please subscribe, like, share, comment, hit the notifications. I don't post all the time, so thanks a lot again, guys. Appreciate it. See you guys in the next one.